the sword and the flute, right. which was the one that introduced you to India and to people that you became very close to. So right. Madhur Jafri, Syed right. Jafri and right. Ismail Merchant. Right. It also had music by Ali Akbar Khan, whose music... It did. Well, uh, just and Ravi Shankar. Yes. Just at that point, Indian music was sort of discovered in the West. Uh, not that it hadn't been before, but that it became kind of popular and, and you could get long playing records and, and and uh, great masters like Ali Akbar Khan and Ravi Shankar came here and concertized all over the country. So there was this whole musical, uh, you know, a, a, a great uh, addition to what I wanted to do. So, and that's where I first began to be interested, of course, in Indian music. So yours was probably one of the first films made by a Western person on this Indian subject using classical Indian musicians? I think. I think probably, yeah. yeah probably no one has done it. I don't, I don't know of anyone else who did. And you use Said Jaffrey, Madhur Jaffrey's former husband, as the person to do the voiceover. Right. And, and I'd had so, uh, another person had recorded who was not Indian, and he'd recorded it, but I just, I just thought it was somehow fighting the images and fighting the mood of the picture. I had to get somebody who's more, well, I mean, you know, Saeed spoke very good English, and, very, and you can say Indian English. I mean, he was a sort of anglicized Indian, you could say, but he was also an actor. So he could do all sorts of things with his voice as an actor. And um, it just, it was just a natural thing. I mean, he, you know. Hmm. I, and it was that film that introduced you to Ismail Merchant. Yes, he saw that film and, and it was being shown uh, at India House in New York, which is the Indian consulate. And it was being shown there and I happened to be there, and luckily. And he came up to me and said, let's get together and talk, and we did.